Long story short, besides developing games for online therapy sessions, I'm also enjoying developing the SLP tools that are meant to help speech therapists balance their day and feel more effective and productive and just basically enjoy their job. And one of the things I'm excited about besides the other three um, is, is the fact that all the tools that an SLP might need for a general day, such as files and um, uh, parent contact information, games, 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 um, all sorts of documentation support, homework, helpers, etc., etc., they are all stored in a very handy place in a secure online virtual office. So anywhere I go that has internet connection, I can just click into my online office and all my stuff is right there. No more losing it or no more carrying everything just in case. And so, like I said, we have the contact information. I also have uh, this homework buddy thing that I, I'm using, which really helps keep the parents in the loop. And so all the children have their own online backpack in a secure site and I put in special games for them and messages to the parents and so they can successfully practice in between my sessions with them and boy oh boy does that make a difference in progress. Another thing is the documentation support. Oh for Pete's sake so many times I have little scraps of papers here and there with plus and minus marks on as I'm really trying to document progress over time during each trial and so um, then I have to go back later and, and do the percentages and make sure I type in my write in my progress notes. Well the thing I'm enjoying about the software is the software takes the data for me and so at the end of a game it's already added up and I just click a button and it goes right to my online progress note which of course is in a secure place online. I can change the progress notes or add to them or do whatever I want to them but the point is the software is helping me get it done faster. I don't have to think really I'm just engaging with the child and helping them do their best. I'm not doing any mathematical things on the side which very nice for me. And, but then let me tell you about the thing that makes me dance. What I'm very excited about is our tickle trunk. Right now I am making this. We already have version one up and ready to go. And now we are making this very exciting addition to it. So picture this. Thousands and thousands of colorful pictures at your fingertips. Now each of these pictures has been programmed in a number of ways such as phonetically, they're all spelled out phonetically for the speech therapist in the database, they're all, the, the, the number of syllables are all added up, um, they're all categorized by category as well. So let's just take a quick moment to do two examples, maybe three, but the, the first quick example is for articulation. Say, oh my goodness, I want to play this go fish game online um, and we're working on beginning R. So I just type in beginning R. All my beginning R pictures come up. I pick the ones I like the most. Whoosh! They're automatically put in to this animated game. Suddenly it's a beginning R game. Maybe next week it will be a beginning TH game. Whatever I want it to be, whoosh, it's automatically put in. And who wants to do anything twice? And so once you make a game, you can store it in your personal tickle trunk and uh, it's yours to use for any client you want uh, again and again and again. Oh, talk about efficiencies that are just built in. Now say we want to talk about language. Oh, I'm working with someone right now and for example, I want to pull up words that will help us talk about pictures, more descriptions. And so maybe I want to type in things that are fluffy and all the fluffy pictures will come up. Or maybe I want to talk about, maybe for a stroke survivor, I want to talk about tools or flowers or vehicles. Or maybe for another early language learner, um, we want to talk about uh, other concepts. But long story short, I type in whatever concept I'm working on and a whole swarm of pictures come up that relate to that goal. And I can, of course, just swoosh those into the games as well. There's just no limit to how many games I have at my fingertips. And they're also colorful and they're all animated. Hallelujah! So 
Maybe I'll also touch on early literacy. We also have the, ca the capacity now to help organize activities for early literacy development like rhyming and syllable counting and, you know, phoneme awareness. You know, things like that. Things that help children enjoy a better quality of life. So it's really exciting putting together these tools and then feeling like there's a magic wand. Whoosh! that just makes it happen, makes the sessions really relevant to my clients, really engaging, and just really effective. Hmm, let's talk more.